Second Topics, Dave Chappelle threatens to pull investment from Ohio town over low-income housing projects. You look like clowns, he's quoted as saying. I was going to read it, but I got the video. I'm going to watch the video of Dave Chappelle saying what he feels, keeping it real. Uh, I see Dave is on. All right, Dave, go ahead. Can you hear me? I can. You're echoing. Oh, yeah. Oh, sorry, about that. sorry about that. Um, I just want to say I'm uh, adamantly opposed to it. Obviously, I live behind the development or the proposed development. Uh, I do have many business interests in town. I've invested millions of dollars in town. If you push this thing through, what I'm investing in is no longer applicable. And I would say that Oberg can come and buy all this property from me if they want to be your benefactor, because I will no longer work. Uh, you, you dropped for a minute there, Dave. The average age in the village is 49 years old. Without a school, you will not attract young families, and this city will not live beyond the retirees that decide to settle here. And I'm surprised that Marianne McQueen is is suddenly uh, not averse to change because you always are when I uh, 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 propose a change. And now all of a sudden we have to recognize the change. These changes are inevitable, but we do have a decision on what they will or could be. And I think we should use more of a visionary eye, uh, eye instead of a reactionary one. Because the potential of this place is immense, and over is not the only solution. Thank you. All right. Thank you. I like to yield the rest of my time to Max Crow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we're all going to yield uh, all I'm our totally time joking, to Max totally Crow for. Uh... <laughs> I know. But for real, over if you um, want right. to try this stuff, come get it. All right. <laughs> uh, No. Can you hear me? Yes. yes. Hi, I'm Dave Spell. <laughs> I just want to say, and Marianne, I could talk to you about this privately. Um, I don't know why the village council would be afraid of litigation from a $24 million a year company while it it's out a $65 million a year company. I cannot believe you would make me audition for you. You look like clowns. I am not bluffing. I will take it all off the table. That's all. Thank you. Uh, I see. That's a man who doesn't want his money going down the drain. I don't, you know, Dave Chappelle doesn't give a fuck about the woke crowd or your, your, your appeasing of the, the low income. No, you're not going to fuck up money in my living situation. You're not going to bring low housing around a $65 million project that I got. You're not going to fuck up my business. He has every fucking right to be upset. And like he said, you're, come, you, you're making me come up here and audition in front of you. You're making us look like clowns. This is not that difficult. You see, when Trump said that about not, not, having the ghetto and the suburbs and shit. Black people went crazy. Oh, he's a racist. He's cold-hearted. He doesn't want them to excel in life. No, he understood property value. He understood business. Dave Chappelle understands property value. He understands business. First-time home buyer. I'm a first-time home buyer. I own my home that I, uh, that I have. All right, I'm paying mortgage, we'll say. I'm not going to front and say that I just went and got the, the, the house in the ghetto or I want it to be racially inclusive. No, 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 no. I wanted to live with the whites. I did. I do. <laughs> and it's not because I hate my race. Or I, I hate Mexicans. No, we have blacks and Mexicans around here as well, but they came out here to get away from the ghetto. The reason why is because there's money to be made out here. 
I bought my house uh, in 2000. What was it 17, 18? I bought it for 181,000. I would make more right now, right fucking now, with inflation and all this crazy shit. If I was to sell my house, I'd make more money and profit than I did buying the house. Think about that. It's business. Property value equals business. When I talk to the the fucking uh, uh, um, the the uh, sales agent that helped me buy the house, I did not want a location. Next to a trailer park. Blacks don't just live in trailer parks. There's white people, Mexican people too. I didn't want that because it lowers property value. See, I'm in this thing to make money. Anything I fucking do is to make money. You see, I'm not a fucking rapper. I don't just talk. I do. Everything that Taj TV has said he was going to do, he's fucking done. Now, all you motherfuckers are sitting in the background with your fucking thumbs up your asses. That's not how I move. Everything I said I was going to do, I've done. Everything I said I am going to do from this point out, I will do. Oh, I'm going to fucking do it. That's the difference between me and these rap niggas. These rap niggas is liars. I ain't a liar. Touch TV ain't no fucking liar. Man of my word. I have integrity, but I have a business mind. Took me a while to get it, but I have it. Dave Chappelle has a business mind. So, salute to you, Dave Chappelle, on not wanting uh, uh, racial diversity at the cost of your bank account. Fuck that. It's all about money. So, check out my comments, see if I got any comments.